Well, thanks for joining us. We finally made it to Friday evening, so uh, way to go on that. Let's take a look at our highs observed for the day. Only 31 in Glasgow, 46 in Jordan, so quite a bit warmer there. 45 in Billings, 38 up in Haver, so the High Line quite a bit cooler. 44 here in Great Falls and 39 in Cupink. Normally this time of the year, average high is 41 for Great Falls. Average low is 22, nowhere near our record. 67 set back in 1936 and negative 19. Set back in 1900 for Helena, uh, average high is 41 degrees, average low 20. Uh, negative 17 was our record set back in 1900 and 64 back in 1966. Moving on to our current conditions elsewhere, 35 in Lewistown and Great Falls, 32 in Cutbank, 37 in Jordan and quite a bit colder in Glasgow, 24. Always talked into that colder air in the northeastern part of the state. Sustained winds right now, calm in Glasgow, so that's a plus. 7 in Lewistown, 9 in Haver, 16 in Great Falls and 14 in Cutbank. And you can see those brighter colors along the Rocky Mountain front. That's where we have quite Quite a bit uh, stronger winds uh, along the past levels. Uh, our current feels like temperature with uh, that wind factored in 28 in Lewistown, 26 in Haver and Great Falls. And for our friends in Cup Bank, 22, 34 in the capital city. Our peak wind gust for today, 38 in Cup Bank, 26 in Lewistown, 28 in Billings, and also for Jordan, 32 here in Great Falls. So Taking a look at our radar loop, not a whole lot to show you, just a few high clouds. Those are moving eastward out of the area and, and uh, along the Rocky Mountain front and just west of Great Falls, we have a thicker area of clouds moving in, but those aren't going to create uh, any precipitation. And uh, we'll take a look at that here on our future track. Just a few high clouds here and there, maybe some upper level uh, uh, precipitation in the higher elevations along Mariah's Pass, maybe near Kalispell, Missoula, a few isolated snow showers. Uh, and then there's a little bit of a system moving through Saturday morning near Haver and the High Line. Uh, we're seeing some snow on the future track, but I don't think we're going to get much out of that system as we head through the period and then look at by the time we head into Sunday afternoon, pretty much mostly sunny skies, a few clouds along the High Line and also the higher elevations. Taking a look at our wind gusts, 10 to 20 miles per hour for the most part for Haver, Great Falls. They could be gusting quite a bit higher along the Rocky Mountain front, which is normal this time of year, especially with warmer temperatures. Uh, 20 to 30 mile per hour gusts Saturday morning. That also goes for Cut Bank. And then as we head into Saturday evening, those are going to die down substantially. Our lows uh, for this evening, 25 in Hayes and for Haver, 27 in Lewistown, 20 for Glasgow and 22 for Jordan, 30 in Cut Bank and 28 here in Great Falls. Our highs tomorrow, 43 in Great Falls, 37 in Cut Bank, 42 in the capital city, 38 in Haver and 39 for Glasgow. Taking a look at our seven day forecast. So mostly sunny skies tomorrow. That's going to last through much of the weekend. Highs in the 40s, 50 on Tuesday. So a slight warm up, but with that wind gust of 40 miles per hour. And then by Thanksgiving, 40 degrees with mostly cloudy skies for the capital city. Uh, breezy tomorrow and then uh, highs in the 40s, mostly sunny for much of the weekend, then some clouds moving in. Slight chance of a snow shower on Wednesday, but for Thanksgiving, cooling off into the 30s. We have our twerking turkey there who's uh, excited for our 